Welcome back to Shine Snark! <laughs> Souls and cool. <laughs> it's me. I'm a good guy. I'm on your side. <laughs> well, as for me, I'm Logan. And I'm... I'm Andy. And, and this guy cool. is so not Belial. Like, he's so not Belial that our character... Yeah, our character is going to be blown away by it. Let's hear him talk about Belial's identity. I have some uh, ideas. Hmm. You have some... Really? Uh, oh, I, I promise I'll find him. He looks like this horn helmet I have on my face. Mm, oh, ooh. Oh, no. Mm, well, okay, to give them credit, small amount of credit, We even our character realizes that that's a bunch of bullshit. That it's... You're clearly Belial. You're... <laughs> You are the bad guy. Oh, this is my favorite room that I just got. Check it out. I suck everybody in, and then I blow them up. Oh, yeah. Me too. Yeah! We suck. And blow! Ha-ha. <laughs> yeah! And we're in another sewer. Yeah, another one. we've been in sewers a while. What's with that? Yeah. Yeah. Only this time it's different because it's an old sewer. Ooh. What is... Why do I have a star on my map? Hold on. Oh! Star on your map? Oh! It's a unique item that I didn't notice uh, that it dropped. I just oh. got a unique sword. Awesome. I'm... Wow, that's a nice thing to start off the episode with. Happy it's birthday. called... Monster Hunter. Sweet. And you didn't have to kill hundreds of uh, identical monsters and put their teeth together to make it. Yeah, that's a step up over that franchise. Am I right, everybody? <laughs> Although, presumably that's that's the draw. Just like in Diablo, killing an infinite number of people is the draw. But that's a great draw, and Monster Hunter's draw is terrible. I don't know. Some people like the idea of crafting shit with their own two hands. Diablo is very anti that, considering that we we literally hire three different people to do that shit for us while we kill things. Yeah, the people that stay behind while we adventure stay the same and are all crafters and people that sell shit. So mm -hmm. basically, we're carrying a city with us as an entourage. We they all come entourage. they they all come either out of like duty or just the fact that we are honestly giving them the most amount of money they could be making right now. And we get all of our stuff duty free from them. Isn't that nice? Yeah. We in, are. Multi in multiple senses of the word. I'm clever, you see. <laughs> we are an economic powerhouse of our own. Yeah, we're basically... Yeah, all, the, all the gold we're picking up here is basically, Virtual. like, lost to the economy. Yeah, we are... We are, uh... We are creating capitalism as we go. We are bringing democracy. <laughs> we are introducing freedom. This dungeon oh, needs I, more freedom. Yeah, we gotta... He needs a nice healthy dose of freedom. Big old fat dose of freedom. I, I've got multiple explosions, by the way. Tell like, me about your explosions. I have explosions from my armor and explosions just because I like to explode. Watch. <laughs> Show me that. Isn't it nice? Very cool. It's just so let's, splendid. Uh, let's reacquaint everyone with our abilities. What do, we, what do, you, what do you got? I got uh, the Law of Hope, which gives us a shield, but is also a passive healing aura. Isn't I that have that exact same thing. I have a passive e healing aura that turns into a shield. So we should never die. It's true, we should never die. I've also got an amazing horse! <laughs> I see you leave fire trails behind you now. Yes, and it does an ass ton of damage, so if I can run around while, uh, run around a group of enemies and just drop fire, na it's just, I'm napalm, it's napalm, I have napalm, napalm I have a horse. napalm horse. <laughs> Good song title. Good song title. I've got my lightning, what is this, Fist of Thunder, which has me teleport to people to hit them, which is awesome. My lashing tail kick, which hits everyone in a cone around me. Nice. I've got the ability to suck people in, as you do. My mm -hmm. dash, of course. And my seven-sided strike, which has me dash all over the place like a maniac. Mm-hmm. My, my normal explosion is this explosion. It's just the charge and blow everybody up. That's great. But then I also have a second explosion that comes from my armor, which I'm charging right now. 
My armor is about to blow up. Oh, I, I kind of missed. But I guess it's fine. I just have to wait. I saw it. 30 seconds. Okay, I'm glad, I'm glad that you saw it. It make, makes me proud that you saw it. It makes me feel like a big man, big strong man with my... Uh, well, at least it makes me feel like a proud, independent woman who don't need no man. See? But you do need a big-ass flail. Oh, yeah. Oh, though, I could use monster... No, it doesn't do enough damage. It's yeah. just doesn't... It's a legendary, but it just doesn't do enough damage. It's kind of tragic. Your legendary doesn't beat out your normal weapon for damage? That's because I put a ruby in it like you did. And oh, yeah. yeah. It's way better. OP. See, we love the game for Diablo. Like, we're going on and on about how we get all these neat things that we can do in the game, because the game designers have done an absolutely splendid job in creating a variety of abilities that just do very neat things. And I, when I first got this rune, the vacuum rune that pulls people in to do the explosion, I sent to Logan, I said, this changes <laughs> everything. That's exactly how he said it, too. Uh-huh. I was, <laughs> I was really happy about it. But, I mean, we're not really... The only thing that I have to complain about is that the change that they made in Reaper of Souls, and this is a big one, because you, you can't salvage items that have been bought from the vendor, because uh, that would break the economy, uh, I guess. Was that, is that new? You couldn't, that you could do that before? You totally could. Really? And you cannot now. Yeah, no, I'm... I'm absolutely certain of it. Like, comment, subscribe, favorite, and leave us a comment on exactly how wrong I am, or if you agree with me. If it, yeah, I, I remembered it. I remember it differently, but I, I don't have a strong opinion about it. I have an extremely strong opinion about it because um, that change wouldn't matter if you could trade items with people that were of any significance. The only thing that you can trade are consumables, either resources or potions, and. Or uh, items that dropped while you're while you're yeah together. while you're actually fighting and that's you know fine and everything but ooh okay. so yeah it's a kind of a shame like uh, Blizzard got rid of the real money auction house which is a, definitely a good thing because it was ridiculous and it really messed up the game like some dude apparently claimed to have made ten thousand dollars on Diablo three alone I don't entirely doubt it. Uh, so that's a good thing overall, but unfortunately they really harshed up the restrictions of, of trading items between people. I, I guess the thinking is, somewhere down the totem pole anyway, that if they're not making money on the auction house, no one ever no. can. What I don't like, though, is that by making like everything untradeable, like, fucking, I can't, look, look. Can I give you this? Yes. That's because we're here... And yeah, but if we go back to town, I take one from my inventory. I cannot give it to you. Yeah, it's, it's a little baby emerald, but I can't give you any of the really good emeralds. Yeah. And that's bullshit. Skeletons yeah. from above! Yeah, like, ah! I've got friends who would love to play this game, who don't play it very much, and I would, you know, I'd like them to, you know, get on my level, so to speak. Yeah, yeah, get on my level, the scrubs. <laughs> but I can't help them. I can only play with them. And that's, you know, it's definitely a good thing, and I love playing with people, and... Uh, uh, I love just... being social, I guess. <laughs> it's just kind of a shame, because the, the... The people that I play... Like, I am probably, like, Woo! me and Andy together are probably the biggest gamers that I know. Yeah. So, other people, you know, who play video games in their spare time, like normal human beings with lives Ooh. and... Things you know, that they do. Social obligation. Uh, you know, I like to be able to give them advantages with my awesomeness. Uh, one to show that I have something to show for my extreme yeah, dedication like, to video look games. At how, look at how big my virtual dick is in the form of these <laughs> virtual gems and swords and whatnot. But also so that we can play in a way that's fun for me and fun for them. Yeah, they get to experience. They get to participate with your level of gaming in a way that doesn't make them feel any more nerdy, makes you feel just the right amount of nerdy, and it is contributing to the overall play experience where you're like, here, have these things, and now you are playing almost as good as I am because I'm giving you these cool things. You can't really fucking do that with this 
item limitation. Blizzard is no fucking us again! <laughs> Corpse piles. Another fucking sewer. And oh, hey! Out. Here's another one of the, like, legitimately good characters in the game. Hey, what's up, Covetous Shan? He's played by James Hong. You might remember him from, well, any Chinese person that was ever in a voice acting role. He's like in his 80s now. Really? Yeah. I remember I'm sad him, because... Not, the thing I really know him from is Big Trouble in Little China, which is probably my fan? favorite movie. Yeah. Yeah. He's... He's a uh, the what's his Mr. Ping in Kung Fu Panda. He's Poe's dad. Oh yeah. yeah. He's and he's. Yeah, I mean seriously, if there's if there's somebody who's Chinese in a cartoon, it's probably him. <laughs> and he's really good at his job, and he does a great job as Covetous Shen. He's a good character. A lot, a lot of the side characters in, in your entourage have really good stories, and that's because Chris Metzen basically was like, I don't want to care about these side quests. You, in turn, do it for me. <laughs> and, like, it... I I hesitate to, to dog on this one guy so very much. Uh, you don't, obviously. I don't. He's the fucking but like, story director. I, 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 he I hesitate. Okay. I, I try to come up with ways that it maybe is not his entire fault. But look, really, all the... No, 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 hold on, I'm agreeing with you. All the evidence really says that whenever literally any other human being does a writing job, it it is better. Yeah, I mean, just it's just facts. Like, literally any person that look, writes... Look, he's decent at realizing what concepts are cool, and that's important in a video game company. I grant that. Yeah, grant definitely. Like, in that. Like he I, I think I've said this already while we were playing, like, the treatment for this game, like, the, this is what I want the story to be like, uh, piece of paper, must have been really impressive. It's like, yeah. a lot of cool concepts. Uh, ow. But the execution is... Mm, I had one of my pain burps, Logan. Oh, no. Ugh. That's, uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but uh, right. the disease that I've got causes me to have burps that always hurt. I have hurty burps. Yeah. Among many other things. Yeah, but that's just the one that happened now, so... Remember how I ran to the toilet last time? You remember that? That was, uh, that was good times. I, I believe everyone uh, was really impressed with how funny I was by myself. Yeah, they they were astounded. <laughs> leave Don't a comment uh, on this video about how you're going to leave a comment on the video where Logan was by himself for like 30 seconds. <laughs> it was a TV event of the season. Also the reason for the season. It was uh, the soul origin, if you will. I have known her! <laughs> When we come back... Uh, the Crucible! Well, Sorry, that's right now. Lewis. But yeah, when we come back. I mean, the results of the Crucible. Oh, that's why you said you had known her. I thought it was in reference to something. Oh, it I was get it. Por que no los dos, mi amigo? Por que no los dos. <laughs>